Hello and welcome to the Bahia Vibe. Today we're going to um, take a little journey on um, clearing blockages and mostly I found that most blockages that we have in our lives um, we are the ones that are putting it and uh, putting them there. I've noticed that we think that we want to do something and we think in order to do that I have to clear this, that will clear that, that will clear that. I mean, I know that for myself um, I function a lot like that because I have a very analytical mind and it is very difficult to um, not see the actual obstacles that we have put in place in order for us not to do something. We can call it um, self-sabotage, we can call it uh, many different things, but nevertheless, the obstacle, the blockage is there. And sometimes the solution is very simple, but we cannot see it. And um, so I thought I would take you on the journey to clear blockages and you may not know or notice that you have put one somewhere and you may not know what that blockage actually looks like but it doesn't really matter because what we're going to do is we're going to do a scan where we're going to see our body as a grid um, within the Merkaba and um, we're going to just pulverize these blockages and um, tomorrow or in the next few days or weeks you're going to notice um, that the, you may not remember right this moment as we're going to do this meditation that you had you have blockages in places but you will notice them after this meditation and go oh right I'm able to do that now because the blockage won't be there anymore and they might be little things really not that we don't think it's a big that big of a deal but it is refraining us and restraining us from from moving forward and um, it could be a um, could become a major issue when you have tiny little ones that amass to a really large one. Get comfortable and let's get started. So for this meditation I need you to uncross your legs and uncross your arms. Be open to receiving. If you can have your hands open as well you can do um, the yoga sitting meditation but don't cross your legs close your eyes and let's take three deep breaths always expanding the belly when we inhale and pulling the belly in when we exhale Release. One more time. And release. And again. And release. Breathe normally as you check in with your body, your shoulders, your neck, your fingers, your hips, your legs, your shoulders. I already said that, but that's okay. The shoulders are usually a major stress point. Feel your body relaxing and feeling more fluid. Breathe normally. And we're 
always going to start with the pineal gland because that is where our third eye is connected and this is where we imagine from. Know that the imaginations come from you and from source. It's a co-creation. So with your eyes closed, I want you to concentrate on your pineal gland, which is situated at the center of your head. We're going to protect ourselves with white light coming from the galactic center. And so we're going to take three deep breaths and we will imagine a cord coming from the galactic center straight through our crown chakra going inside all of our body and coming out from the Kundalini. And then the light will wrap around all of our body and surround us. This is how forceful I need you to take those deep breaths, expanding the belly and pulling it in when you breathe out. I want you to imagine this white light expanding and expanding. It's coming out of your breath as well. Are you ready? Let's take a deep breath. Pulling the white light from the galactic center, which is really, really, really high up there. Hold it. And release. Visualize the white light going through all your veins, all your arms and legs, your neck, your shoulders, your fingers. It is vibrating. It is coming out of your fingers, vibrating. You are filled with white light. Let's take another deep breath. And release. The white light is circulating in all of your atoms within your body. It is circulating in your hair, in your toes. It is circulating everywhere. We're going to take another deep breath, forcefully pulling in the white light from the galactic center. Let's go. And release. We are now filled with white light and the white light is coming out of all of our extremities through our feet, through the palm of our feet, the palm of our hands. The white light is now starting to form a circle around our body and spiraling from head to toe. We are surrounded and protected, it is forming a pillar and when we breathe out we are expanding that pillar of white light, it looks like white smoke. Breathe in, breathe out and expand that pillar of white light surrounding you and now you feel Breathe normally and stay quiet in this white light. Feel how you are floating. Energy is already coming in your hands. a point that is starting to pulse on your third eye. This point is joining to your left shoulder, making a line 
between them. And then another point from the third eye is joining to your right shoulder. And from there, from both of your shoulders, another line forms all the way to your hands. From there, from your hands, two lines are forming to your feet. And from your feet, two lines are joining. It's pointing. And it's going to be direct opposition to the third eye. From one of your hip, the right hip, Another line is joining to the left hip. This is the grid we are going to work with today. We're going to take small breaths where we will visualize the energy coming in from earth core, chakra 13. And it's going to circulate in our body. Ready? Let's take gentle breath from Earth Core through your Kundalini and then visualize the energy going through all of your body. Ready? It should be a pale silver green light. Imagine this energy circulating within your joints, your hands, your face, your veins in your face, under your eyes, your eyebrows. Breathe normally. Imagine that energy going through your hair, your ears, your earlobes, your teeth, your neck, the veins in your neck, your upper chest, your belly. And now, while you're doing that, I want you to notice if there is any little block a place where it has a hard time flowing. I remember those points. And when you find one, I want you to take a deep breath from Earth Core, all the way circulating through that point. And clear that blockage. Let's go. If it's in your hands, it means there is something you cannot put your hands on. Something you do not have a grasp on. Something you have a hard time handling with your hands, or something slipping from your hands, something you think you are losing. So breathe through that and give your hands the energy back. If it's in your shoulders. It is something that is weighing you down. Something 
that you're carrying on your back that is too heavy for you something in your life too many people are counting on you and you don't know how to manage that weight within your life breathe through that really imagine that point that is blocking clearing as the more you breathe through it the more it's clearing If the blockages in your head, perhaps you're thinking too much and your thinking is stopping you from moving forward, from making a decision, for just doing it because you think that you have to have it all figured out. So breathe through that, breathe through your head, always pulling the energy from earth core is the healing energy. Now perhaps the blockage is in your feet. This means moving, advancing. Something is stopping you from taking the next step. What is it? Where do you think you're supposed to go and you don't think you can? Put one step forward and then the next step. Step into that power. Step into that reality. Breathe through your feet if the point is through your feet. What if the blockages in your navel? This is your base, the base of your body is what balances your energies. You don't feel that you are in the right place. You don't feel at home it's not familiar to you so you're afraid of this unknown breathe through the navel and tell yourself you do belong tell yourself you're not afraid to this for this new place Breathe through the navel. What if the pain, the blockage of the energies is not really moving very well in your throat chakra? This is your expression. Perhaps you do not think you have the right tools to express yourself. Perhaps there are things you would like to say, but you do not dare because you are thinking about the other person, how it's going to land, 
how is it going to be interpreted? But the truth is, this thought needs to be expressed and leave your body. So, breathe through your crown chakra. Sorry. Breathe through your throat chakra and open it up and ask for the right words to come in so that you will know exactly how to formulate what you have to say. Breathe through the throat chakra. What if the pain is in your arms? Perhaps you are afraid to open your arms to receive. Perhaps you are on the verge of receiving and you are afraid of what it would look like or you are not letting go of the control of what you are about to receive that's interesting that's what I'm getting someone in the group is not letting go to receive. Let's breathe through the arms and visualize them opening up. Open your arms to receive. Do not be afraid of that. What if the pain is on your back? It's a little bit like the shoulders, only on the back. We also hold and carry the past, the past. And so we are not moving forward because the past is blocking us. So let's remind ourselves that the past does not exist. And a bright future wants to come in, but we are holding on to the past because it is what we know. And because we think that it has made us who we are. The past has participated in shaping you today as a survivor. Today, you are colored with the past but it's only one layer to who you are. Today is today. The time is now. So let's release this past that we think we have to carry with us because we are afraid that we would lose our identity. Forgetting the past does not make you lose your identity. Be 
because your identity is ever always improving, changing, elevating. You can no longer be the past. You can no longer associate with it since every single day new experiences, new things come into your life that make you a new you. So let's breathe through the back and unblock. Keep working on the points that are blocked until the energy is able to go through. Until you, re you visualize all of the energy from Earth. Until you visualize all of the energy from Earth core floating and flowing within all of your veins and all of the pathways within your body, your joints, your muscles, your skin, until you find the perfect harmony going from one point to another within the grid that we have designed. And once the energy is able to go through all of your body flawlessly, We will take a deep breath and on the inhale, we will pull energy from Earth core and the galactic center at the same time. It's called the heliotelic breath. And that breath will meet at our solar plexus, the heart chakra. And we will pull all of this energy into the heart chakra. for the final unblocking. Ready? We're gonna pull from both places at the same time. Ready? Go. And release into the solar plexus at the heart chakra. Feel the warmth of the energy from Earth Core meeting with the Galactic Center. Feel how warm that energy is coming from the collective consciousness. We have all of us just connected to the collective consciousness through the heart We are aware of our connection to the galactic consciousness. As a collective, we do individual work and we see ourselves as antennas, Tesla coils. That's what we are. Each one of us is a Tesla coil. We are vibrating beings. That's what we work with, vibrations. The 
vibration of earth core, Terra, the vibrations of the galactic center within the universe, the collective consciousness, and our own individual vibration. Feel this connection with everyone and everything. We are here for you. We know you. Your blockages are nothing but a mirage. You are stronger than that. You created them. Now you can uncreate them. Your blockages are merely there for you to step up your game. When you undo a blockage, you gain more strength, more confidence, and then you realize that the more blockages you undo, the higher your strength. You are a very powerful being. Nothing is real on this planet. Nothing is impossible. Just trust yourself. You can do anything. From now on, the past won't hold you back. Your thinking won't hold you back. Fear won't hold you back. Breathe normally. See this energy flowing through your body perfectly. Unstoppable. Warming your whole body. Visualize at your heart chakra. This energy is pulsing. And with each pulse, feel the connection to the galactic center, to the collective consciousness. Our fellow humans are meeting at that point with their own consciousness to the collective. Breathe normally. any emotions, joy, sadness, anything, fear, let them go. Visualize 
space with the music. We now say thank you to the Galactic Center for guiding us today, for removing these blockages from our realities, so that we can move forward, so that we can regain our freedom of choice, of expression, freedom to move around to do what we'd like to do without these blockages. We say thank you to the collective consciousness for working the quantum so that this can happen. And as we do so, we remove blockages. from our body, from our lives, our surroundings, and we view everything with the flow of energy, effortlessly, and we feel more at peace and calm. Because this burden is gone. Starting now, the solutions will just find their ways to us. They will just appear. Thank you again for joining me on this meditation. Whenever you are ready, you can open your eyes. Notice how you feel. I hope you enjoyed this meditation. And uh, sorry about the, the noise. There's a lot of birds outside my window, but I think it's always very nice to have them. It's a nice sound anyway. And I hope that uh, if you shake your body a little bit, move it around, see these blockages leaving, I hope this helped you to actually notice them within your body because we do imprint in our bodies and uh, until next time have a great end of the week and weekend and thanks again for your donations they're much appreciated and see you next time